Ladies and gentlemen, sustainable tourism is good for the country and brings long-term sustainability to the future. This is considered an inevitable trend for all countries in applauding and developing the smokeless industry. For Vietnam in general, Kanthar City in particular, sustainable tourism is an interesting concept and there are very positive starting signals in building HWA proposing solutions for the aforementioned tourism model. The Swiss Federal Directorate for Economic Affairs has had a working session with leaders of Kansas City People's Committee on the project on sustainable tourism development in Vietnam. The project, with the support of the Swiss government, has been started in early April 2023. Accordingly to the project, the Swiss side will support national policy making in promoting policies on sustainable tourism and help improve the capacity of Vietnam's tourism training institutions to meet the training and professional development on sustainable tourism. Consider the interdepartment cooperation to have a strong interdepartmental cooperation because tourism touches upon many different sectors. On the second point, on your second questions regarding what would uh, the, the scope of the project be if uh, Kanto were to be selected, um, we cannot be too detailed at the moment now because, as you mentioned, we are still in the process of selecting. But in general, what we are doing is uh, we are promoting the public-private sector dialogue on sustainable tourism policy. The World Tourism Organization defines sustainable tourism as the development of tourism activities to meet the current needs of tourists and indigenous people while still being concerned with the conservation and embarrassment of resources for the development of tourism activities in the future. With its drawn and central location in the Meko Delta, Kanto has great potential for tourism development. Over the years, tourism infrastructure has gradually been invested and upgraded in the direction of modernity to meet the needs of sightseeing and relaxation of domestic and foreign tourists. And now the city is also developing a set of criteria for green and sustainable tourism in the future. This set of criteria covers a wide range of content. Generally speaking, the criteria aims to instruct travel units on how to develop the best local tourism environments at the lowest price so that foreign visitors can feel that our tourism criteria must with international tourism. Each locality has its own business features. Therefore, there is a crucial need for exchanges between tourism businesses and local management units so that we can single out suitable criteria. Last but not least, after the set of criteria is built up, how to publicize it is very important. Lots of training courses must be organized and awareness must be heightened by then travel businesses can succeed in following the criteria. Kentur has many attractive tourism products for tourists. However, in general, the connection of different types of tourism as well as the building of typical tourism products still have certain limitations. Therefore, through building a sustainable tourism model, the city is best to better exploit the available potentials and advantages to bring the local smoke-free industry soon to become a spearhead economic sector.